dropshipping tools and software allow us to automate most of our daily tasks so that we can invest our time in growing and scaling our dropshipping business. That is why in this video, I'm going to go over two dropshipping tools, Oberlo and Spocket, and help you understand and choose which software and tool is the best for your business to help automate, scale, and make much more sales and profit. Quick intro and let's go. Welcome back. I'm Liran, the content manager here at AutoDS. And as you know, in this video, we're going to talk about Oberlo and Spocket, make a nice comparison between the two and see which is better for your dropshipping business. For those of you who don't know, dropshipping tools are here to help us automate our daily tasks and simply help us scale our businesses by allowing us to invest our time in only the most important tasks, while the regular tasks like price and stock monitoring, importing products, and even automating our orders can all be 100% automated. So let's go ahead and get started. One second before that, subscribe to our YouTube channel channel to always stay updated and learn about the next move in your dropshipping business. We've got so much content that came out and that's coming out in the future. So be sure to stay tuned on our YouTube channel and of course on our blog page, which you can also read this article, Spocket versus Oberlo, which dropshipping tool is the best for your business. So if you're the type that likes to read, you can use the link right below this video and go ahead and read through this article. So why even use dropshipping automation tools in the first place? As I mentioned, you're going to be able to take advantage of great things things like price and stock monitoring. So if the prices change on my supplier's website and, I, and I'm selling their products on my selling channel, I want the price or the stock to change accordingly to what's happening with my suppliers. This way, you won't have to refresh your suppliers pages all day every day and see if there are any price or stock changes. Then you've got quick product importing. So instead of manually importing all of your products one by one from your suppliers websites and grabbing all of the images and the item specifications and moving them all one by one, meaning importing one product can take even 20 or 30 minutes. And if you want to get thousands of or even hundreds of products on your store, it's going to take that much amount of time, which is not worth it, especially if you want to grow and scale. More things that you'll get from dropshipping tools is order automation. So when an order comes in from one of your buyers, you can have it automated for you, meaning processing the order gets done automatically even while you travel, even while you sleep. And this once again saves you a whole bunch of time and allows your buyers to get their products pretty quickly, much faster than they would have to wait if you would have to do it manually. Also dropshipping tools and software can help us with our product research phase, which is one of the most important parts when running our dropshipping businesses because we always want to sell the right products and dropshipping tools and software can help us find those products and in some cases also know what audiences to target with those products. So let's go ahead and get started. Those are some of the main advantages that we're going to get from dropshipping tools. So what is Oberlo? For those of you who haven't heard of them, Oberlo is a dropshipping tool that allows you to automate your Shopify dropshipping store. So it's only relevant if you're dropshipping on Shopify and they synchronize with AliExpress, meaning you can import products from AliExpress to Oberlo and you can do that all through their platform. So this is what their main website looks like. And if you want to create an account, simply click right up here on become a member. And some of the advantages that you will have when working with Oberlo is that overall they have a pretty user-friendly interface. They're also available in multiple languages. They have semi-automatic orders, which means it's not 100% automated. And I'll talk about that soon, but you still have semi-order automation and a wide range of product choices, even though they're all coming from AliExpress. Now let's talk about some of the cons that we have when working with Oberlo. First of all, you have limited supported suppliers. In this case, only one supplier, which is AliExpress. The second disadvantage is that they work only with Shopify. So Shopify is your selling channel. AliExpress is your supplier. That's where it starts and ends with Oberlo. Another disadvantage is that you have relatively slow shipping times when using Oberlo because you're dropshipping from AliExpress and because most of the products from AliExpress are being sourced from China. So when you're selling from China to the US or to the UK or to Canada or to any other marketplace, any other region around the world, you will notice relatively slow shipping times, which is not something that buyers like to see and experience. So those are some of the pros and cons of working with Oberlo. And I will show you their platform more in depth soon. Now let's learn briefly about Spocket. Spocket is another tool that once again 
allows you to dropship and automate your dropshipping business using their tool. This is what their main website looks like. To get started, simply click on the get started link right up here and create your account. Some of the pros that we have when working with Spocket. First of all, they work with US and Europe suppliers. So this is already different from Oblo who works only with AliExpress from China. Even though AliExpress does have multiple warehouses around the world, so you can find some items that are being sourced in the US, but the majority is going to be in China. That is AliExpress's bread and butter. So Shopify works with verified US and EU suppliers who they check themselves, which means they have stricter policies when these suppliers want to join their platform and they also integrate with nine selling channels so if i go to their website and i hover over integrations you can see all of the selling channels that they support today so whereas overlo only supports Shopify, here you have more marketplaces like Wix, WooCommerce, BigCommerce, Squarespace, Equid, and so forth. And in this case, since we're working with suppliers who are from the US or from Europe, we're gonna get fast shipping times if those are the countries that we are targeting. So if I'm dropshipping from US warehouses to the US audience or from European warehouses to the European audience, we're gonna get very fast shipping times, which is different when dropshipping from AliExpress. Some of the cons of working with Spocket is that their subscription fees are simply more expensive and I will show you them soon. You have fewer product choices, even though you have suppliers from US and Europe, what about the rest of the regions and what about the rest of the suppliers inside those regions that you can work with? In this case, Spocket only allows you to work with the verified US and EU suppliers that they have integrated already inside the system. After you create your account with Spocket, you're gonna get a dashboard that looks like this. And as you see, we have a whole bunch of products right here in the US slash EU products, which is the default page that you're gonna get as soon as you log in. So as you can see right here, I'm seeing a whole bunch of products. I can choose different categories. And what I wanna do here is choose what products to sell on my store. So first things first, you wanna connect your store. So down here on the bottom left, you're gonna click on my shop and connect the shop that you have. Once your shop is connected, you can go back to the search products or to the US EU products. They're also adding AliExpress, which is relatively new. And this means that you're going to have to download and install the Ali Scraper Chrome dropshipping extension. So if you wanna also source products from AliExpress, you're gonna need another extension to use here. Now, I haven't seen it in action yet. So if you've tried AliExpress with Spocket, let me know in the comments below and if that feature is working well. So what you're going to do after you connect your store is choose what products you wanna sell and then you're going to add it to your import list. Once it's on your import list here on the left side, you'll be able to see it and optimize it before moving it to the My Products section, which here the product will be live on your store, whichever store you connected, and people will be able to go and purchase those products. You'll also be able to see your orders in the My Order section right here on the left side and messages where you can send messages to the suppliers that you are working with don't get it confused with buyer messages, which is not being synchronized to your store. So that is a basic overview of Spocket's platform, how it looks and how it works. Now let's take a quick look at Orbelo. So once again, you're gonna click on become a member to create your account. And once you have your account, your dashboard is gonna look like this. Now here you have an onboarding process which can help you get started. And the first step that you wanna take, just like Spocket, is to first of all, create or connect your dropshipping store. So in this case, I've got my Shopify store right here. It's called Doggy Dog Club. And the shop's name is Pet Shop Discounts, as you can see in the URL right up here. So I'm just gonna copy the name before the .myshopify.com. Then I'm going to click on create or connect store and enter my URL right here. So petshopdiscounts.myshopify.com. I'm going to click on connect my store. In this case, the shop is already connected to Orbelo, so of course I'm gonna get that error message. But if I go back to my Shopify dashboard and I'll click on apps here on the left side, I'll be able to see that Orbelo is one of those apps as you can see right here. This means that I can already take advantage of what Orbelo has to offer. Now in this case, it looks like Spocket where you have your import list and the products where the import list is the products that you are interested in. So you put them in this directory for now. And after you optimize them, you synchronize them with the products category, which this section means once again, that the products are actually live on your store. Then you've got the orders where you can see the orders that came in and notifications if you have any. So first we're gonna start off by looking for products. So we're gonna click on find products. And here, as you know, since Orbelo is working only with AliExpress, we're going to see products that are being sourced from AliExpress. So here, for example, you can go over the products, choose what's right for your store after doing your product research, and then add it to your import list. Once it's on your import list, you can edit it from here 
here, edit on import list. And this is where you start optimizing the product. Okay, you can also click on import list here on the left side. Once you finish going over the product and the variations, the pricing, description, and images, click on import to store, and it'll move over to the product section right here on the left side, which as mentioned, means that your product is live on your store and people can go in and start buying it. So that is basically how things work here on Oberlo. So which is better? What are the main differences? Let's continue. Here are the main differences and similarities between Spocket and Oberlo. The main similarities are they both integrate with Shopify stores. So if you have a Shopify dropshipping store, both of them support it. They both support finding products to sell. Whether working with one supplier or multiple suppliers, they both support an internal tool to help you find products to sell. They both also have an orders dashboard where you can see all of the orders that came into your dropshipping store and they both support semi-order automation. Now let's talk about that for a second. What is semi-order automation? What this means is when an order comes in, it can still be automated by Spocket or by Orbelo, but on the other hand, Spocket and Orbelo are using your buyer accounts to process your orders. What does this mean, your buyer accounts? It means that if, for example, AliExpress is your supplier and you created an account in AliExpress, you created your buyer account there, you have your payment settings set up, then you have to connect that AliExpress account to Spocket or to Oberlo, and this way they'll have your AliExpress account details and they'll use your account details and your payment methods inside your account to process your orders, to pay for your orders and to process them. So that is what semi-order automation means. Your orders are being automated, but it's using your buyer accounts. So if there's ever a problem with your buyer accounts or the credit card on file is no good or any other reason, your orders will stop being automated. Another similarity that's worth mentioning is that when adding products from suppliers, from the suppliers that they have integrated into their system, all that works fine and well. But if you wanna go to the suppliers websites manually and choose products from their websites manually and add those products to those tools, you will not be able to because you have to use the internal software to find the products inside the tool. So once again, you can just go to aliexpress.com, choose your products from there, and then import them to your store using a quick button. You're going to have to find it inside their integrated tool. So that makes things a little bit less easy, but that's another similarity for them both that's worth mentioning. The differences between Spocket and Oberlo, the main differences that, that stand out is their supported selling channels. As you know, Oberlo has only Shopify and Spocket has about nine selling channels available. The next difference is the supported suppliers, which once again, as you know by now, Oberlo has only one supported supplier, which is AliExpress, whereas Spocket has European and US suppliers that are integrated into the system. And they also recently added AliExpress, which requires you to have the Ali Scraper Chrome extension tool. So we've also got the product range and this goes together with suppliers. The suppliers offer the range. So if you offer less suppliers, you're offering less of a product range. Shipping times, of course, is a great difference between the two because on one, you're sourcing products mainly from China, meaning you're going to get slower shipping times. And in the other, you're sourcing products from US or Europe, meaning you can target the same audiences in the same regions and get faster shipping times. Now for the branding effect, Spocket is the clear winner here, since with Spocket, you can create customized invoices to your buyers and add your own logo with your brand. This helps add more to the branding effect of your store, and this is only possible through Spocket since Oberlo does not have this feature. And now let's go over the pricing plans and see the differences between Spocket and Oberlo. So as you see right here, I've got both of their pricing plan pages open and we can see the differences. While they both have a free plan, as you can see here. So on the right side, we've got a free plan from Oberlo, and on the left side, we've got a free plan from Spocket. Only the free plan means, on Spocket right now, let's start with Spocket. So the free plan means that you can browse around their platform, but you can't really do anything. You can't add your Shopify store. You can't start adding products to your import list. This is simply once again, to browse around their platform and see what they have to offer. Then you've got the starter plan, which allows you to import 25 products, which if you ask me is simply not enough. You're not gonna be making much sales with 25 products. And the reason that you are here is to make sales, is to make profit, 
And once again, with 25 products, that is just not going to happen. Unless you're going with a one product store, which are much more challenging to be successful on, especially if you are a beginner. Then you've got the pro plan, which allows you to add 250 products, which still, if you ask me, is not enough, especially if you want to make great profits and not just a profit. Then you've got the empire plan at $100 a month. Now it's not cheap anymore, but at 10,000 unique products, you can definitely make some substantial sales and profit with that many products in your dropshipping stores. Now, of course, these are the monthly plans. You can also click on yearly and get the cheaper version of each plan. But of course, this means a one-time payment in advance for all of the 12 months up ahead. Now on Orbolo, as I mentioned, you've got the free plan and this one offers a little bit more than what Spocket does on their free plan. With Orbolo's free plan, you can import up to 500 products from AliExpress, unlimited monthly orders, meaning no matter how many orders you're gonna get, you're gonna see it right here on the orders page and Orbolo's Chrome extension is included and variant mapping, but you won't have access to things like bulk orders, meaning semi-automatic orders in bulk. You don't have shipment tracking, which means tracking information will not be updated, which is one of the most important things if you ask me. As soon as tracking information is available on one of your orders, you need it to be updated on your store. You won't have multiple staff accounts, meaning if you have virtual assistants helping you run and maintain and grow your dropshipping business, you won't have it in the free plan, no affiliate program if you want to be an affiliate for Oblo, and no CAPTCHA solver. And in the boss plan, at just $30 a month, which isn't that expensive if you ask me, here you have a product limit of 30,000, good luck getting to 30,000 optimized products, that is way more than enough, unlimited orders, and everything else that was a no on the free plan is a yes in the $30 a month plan. So Orbolo does give a good price here, but on the other hand, you do get what you pay for. You're only getting Shopify and you're only getting AliExpress. Now, if you wanna see a full comparison chart, once again, read the blog below this video. I'm going to scroll through it since we went through all of the important things. And now the verdict. And in the verdict to know what is the best dropshipping tool, I couldn't help myself but to also add AutoTS here because there are significant differences between these three dropshipping tools. So you already know all of the important things about Spocket and Orbelo. Now let's talk about AutoDS and the features and what you can do when using this tool. First of all, you have access to tens of millions of products because AutoDS supports over 25 dropshipping suppliers. So not just some EU suppliers, not just some US suppliers, and not just AliExpress. Over 25 dropshipping suppliers where you can simply head on over to their website, choose what products you wanna add, and use the single product importer or the bulk product importer to grab as many products as you want and import them in a matter of seconds to your dropshipping stores. Then you've also got an easy product research tool. With Easy Product Research, you can simply choose what products you want to add. And I'll show you an example right here on the top left side of the AutoDS platform. We're going to switch from the platform to the product research tool. And here you will see all of the products that you can add from multiple suppliers around the world. You can also click on popular products to see all of the products that have high ratings. And of course, inside each product page, you have customer reviews. You have where the product is coming from, how long it's going to take. Like this example right here, we, we have this three tier shoe rack bench. The item cost is $69. You have a suggested retail price, but of course you can price it however you see fit. You have the product reviews that this product has from customers who actually bought this product. A total of 600 reviews all of the products information, specifications, the shipping return policies, and you can also read the product reviews from here. And if you're interested in this product, you're simply going to click on import product right up here, and it'll import to whatever store you have set right here. So you've got the product research tool. You can also head out over to the left side to holiday products to prepare for the next holiday, or you can stick only to US suppliers or only to China suppliers, depending on what type of suppliers you wanna target and what type of audience you wanna target. And soon, we're also going to be adding wholesale private dropshipping suppliers to the product research section right here, meaning only the AutoTS members will have exclusive access to products that no one else has access to. And of course, you can play with the variations however way you like. You can create one product listing, add its variations, and then add more variations from multiple from other suppliers and even from other regions to your same product page, meaning your product page it's, is excellent, it's unique, nobody else has it, and you can easily differentiate yourself from the competition this way. That is just one idea. So you've got millions of products that you can reach, easy product research tools, and that's not the only one, automated order fulfillment, and this is different from the semi-automatic orders that we talked in, up until now. 
you still have semi-automatic orders with AutoDS, just like Spocket and Orbolo, but with AutoDS, you also have the fulfilled by AutoDS service, meaning this is 100% automation. As soon as an order comes in, it gets fulfilled not using your buyer accounts. You don't need to have any. AutoDS have more than enough buyer accounts with the suppliers that they support for the fulfilled by AutoDS service, which is all of the US suppliers that charge US dollar currencies. You can use the fulfilled by AutoDS service with them today. And once again, all the orders are automated. You don't need to worry about your buyer accounts getting locked, your credit line at the bank, Everything is being automated. Simply top up your AutoDS balance. We have more than enough video explanations and articles and help guides on that. But this is 100% true order automation. Of course, with automatic tracking updates from day one, automatic messages to your buyers if you're drop shipping on selling channels like eBay, and simple and easy one-click returns when using the Fulfilled by AutoDS service. So as soon as a customer wants to return a product, we're simply going to switch the order status to request a return and a print label, a return label, will be uploaded next to that order accordingly. That is, of course, if you are eligible for a return, depending on your supplier's policies. Now, speaking of selling channels, on AutoDS, you can dropship on eBay, Shopify, Facebook Marketplace, which is a great, great place if you live in the US, and Wix. And soon we're going to be adding much more selling channels like WooCommerce, BigCommerce, Amazon, and that's all that I have in my head right now, but there is much, much more coming up. And those of you who have known us for a while, up until I think a year and a half ago, it was just eBay. Next, you've also got effective branding solutions with AutoDS with free store templates for you to use. And of course, you can also add your own and you can customize the templates that you have inside the system, but you have many templates to choose and create a better visualization effect for your buyers while also adding in your own brand elements and style. You can also easily and efficiently optimize your store using AutoDS with its rich and intuitive dashboard showing you all of your business's metrics in one place. Let me just show you a quick look of how the platform looks like and what options you have inside. I'm not gonna take you step by step. For that, you have our blog page, you have our help section, you have so much to explain everything about the system and how it works. But here, as soon as you log in, you'll have this onboarding page right here with our most popular videos from our YouTube channel on in all of the different selling channels. So as you see, we've got eBay, Shopify, Facebook Marketplace, general, which means it's right for all selling channels, technical things, how to use the platform and new features that came out, product finding, which we show you the best products for you to sell. And that is just the front page. You've also got the dashboard where you can see what's going on in your business. And here, this is just a demo store. So of course you're seeing everything on zero. Here on the top left, you can choose what stores you wanna see. So here, for example, I can select all of my eBay stores, all of my Shopify stores, my Facebook Marketplace store and my Wix store. So all four selling channels were just added to the dashboard. It's only showing me a week back on this demo account. So once again, you're not gonna be seeing any numbers, but you can see the whole business metrics overview, how much you've been profiting at a certain date range, the currency that you wanna see on the dashboard, how many orders, the revenue, how many new products you added, your best selling products and tags, and the sales overview in a graph. Once again, no information here since it's a demo account, but you get the picture. Then you've got the order screen, and this is where you can see all of the orders that came in on all of the stores that you selected on the top left. And here, if you have the fulfilled by AutoDS system, your orders are going to be fulfilled. You can also send it to auto order manually if you don't want every order to be processed automatically as soon as it comes in. Or of course, you can manually process it using your dropshipping supplier, change it to ordered with the order ID and so forth. But this is what the orders page looks like and everything can be 100% automated. The status will change to ordered and it'll change to shipped and delivered accordingly with the order ID on ordered, with the tracking information on shipped and so forth. You've also got tracking conversion. So if you're dropshipping, for example, from Amazon and Amazon supplies you with an AMZL tracking number, which is not trackable, you can get your tracking number converted automatically using the automatic order service. Then you've got the drafts page, which is all of the products that you added from your dropshipping suppliers before you import them to your store and having it go live. So this is where you can optimize the product's information, the description, the variations, the images, item specifications, and so forth. And when you're done, you're going to import it to your store and it'll move from drafts to products, meaning now it's live on your store and anyone can go and buy it. So in the products page, you can see all of your products, how many variations are available in stock, your pricing, your profits, the item ID, the selling channels, like here, for example, this product is on Wix, this product is on the Shopify store and so forth days without sale, what store it's on, and much, much more information, especially once you start to customize your columns. Then you've got the customer support section, which is where you can talk to all of your buyers, communicate with your buyers if you're dropshipping on eBay, 
take care of cases, requests, and so forth. So you can do it all on one page, even if you have multiple stores. And you've got the AutoDS wallet, which is in partnership with Payoneer, meaning you have a full synchronization system between the AutoDS wallet and Payoneer, so you can easily withdraw funds from Payoneer to your AutoDS managed account and start processing your orders from here, pay for your subscriptions, and so forth. That is a quick run through on AutoDS. I didn't even go over the adding product section, how you can import your products really easily, whether single or multiple or using the AutoDS Finder, which I haven't talked about. There are much, much more features for you to learn and get to know. And we've also got exclusive content right here at AutoDS. If you've ever been to AutoDS.com, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. Simply hover over the top right here and see all of the great things that we have going on, like our product research tool, which I talked about, automated orders, price optimization settings, tracking number updates, the importer price and stock monitoring fulfilled by AutoDS, inventory management, integrations that we have, suppliers that you can work with. And here in the resources, you have a lot that will help you with your dropshipping business, like the dropshipping blog that's always being updated with the hottest topics to help you run and manage a successful dropshipping business. You've got eBooks, podcasts, a mentorship program, which is where you're going to get one-to-one -one help with our number one dropshipping mentor to help you scale your dropshipping business if you already started or start the right way if you haven't started yet. We've also got dropshipping courses, webinars, an eBay fees calculator, an e-commerce calendar, and more of those types of features also coming up. So here you can read and learn about dropshipping, which is updating at least two times a week. So twice a week, new content, great eBooks. Everything here is 100% free. And you've also got the courses page, which I mentioned. You've got a free Shopify course, about 40 lessons there. Everything is included there. And the same goes for Facebook Marketplace. Same goes for eBay. eBay is not free, but it doesn't cost that much either. And you can do all of this and you can manage your business and you can successfully scale and manage your dropshipping store 100% automated, all for just $1. So start your $1 trial and see where you're gonna take it from there. I'm sure that you're going to love that $1 trial and then you'll continue with a monthly or annual plan. And while the pricing is always subject to change, you can see right here on the pricing section, choose whichever selling channel you wanna start off with. And then you've got your prices right here. So it's really easy and cheap to get started. And this is after your seven day trial, meaning you've already got products on your store, you've got automation going on, and you're already making some sales or about to make some sales. So it won't be a problem to put up with just $13 a month to help you get started with 400 products, not 20, not zero, 400 products is enough to get started and start making sales. And then that $13 a month is nothing which you can make up in one to two sales inside those 400 variations. And so many more things included in the starter plan, including of course, support for automatic orders, all of the import settings, all of the automation settings and everything else that we have going on. So starting off is cheap, start the right way, start making those sales, automate your dropshipping business the right way. And I hope that I helped you in this video understand what is the best dropshipping tool for you to use with all of the reasons why. So you've got all of the features, you've got all of the benefits, you've got all of the pricing plans. Now I want you to make the right decision for your dropshipping business. Use the best tool that you can to help automate everything and not just some things. And this way you will be able to automate your dropshipping business, scale successfully, and start making lots and lots of sales and profits. Thank you for watching this video. Once again, I hope that it helped you out. Let me know in the comments below if you have any questions or comments. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to always stay updated on all of the latest and all of the hottest topics that we have coming out in the world of dropshipping. Thank you for watching and good luck choosing your dropshipping tool.